All right, good afternoon, everybody. It's your boy Akeem. Welcome to this blog. Here to give you a preview for the Texas Raiders for the 2015 college football season. Now, last year, click Kiff. Cliff Kingsbury and company had a terrible year going 4-8, and eight, and this could be the last season for King Cliff Kingsbury. He needs to do a much better job, particularly on the defensive side, allowing a terrible 41 points allowed per game. They need to do a much better job defensively, and they need a lot of help. Now, on the offensive side, they have a couple of good weapons for quarterback Davis Webb, who did have 24 touchdown passes last season and 13 interceptions. He needs to do a better job with his decision-making in passing, but I think this is a decent quarterback, and with Cliff Kingsbury, who is a former Raider quarterback himself, breaking records before he left, I think he can help the Davis Webb become a good um, starter for that offense. Now, at running back, I think they have an excellent playmaker in DeAndre Washington. I think he's their best player on the offensive side. He had over 1,100 yards rushing last season and over 300 yards receiving, but only four total touchdowns. He needs to do, I think they need to put the ball in his hands. I think he's a great player maker. I think he's a good home run threat. He just needs the ball placed in his hands and he can make the magic happen. I do believe in this running back and underrated running back entering this season. Lastly, Jakeem Grant, the wide receiver, he had just under a thousand yards last season with 938 yards receiving and seven scores. Now on the defensive side, the only two players that I do like kind of kind of like is Pete Robinson, the linebacker, as well as the defensive back and Keenan Ward. I think those are good returning players this upcoming season, but but they still need a lot of help. They need to do a better job tackling and getting better into their schemes and understanding their offensive opponents. I think they just need, and not the talent, I just think they need better discipline on that defensive side. That is terrible. 41 points allowed per game. Now, they did pick up four of uh, three four star recruits um, this past offseason in um, recruiting and starting with um, Braden um, um, Fihaluhu out of uh, Honolulu, Hawaii. He's actually the number 10 defensive tackle coming out of ESPN. As well as they picked up a good um, defensive back out of Dallas, Texas, and Jamel of Washington Jr., Oh, Johnson Jr., as well as Corey Dufresne, a, the number 25 running back coming out of high school. He was actually considered a four-star recruit according to ESPN. I think this is some great additions. So hopefully the, the, the two players that I mentioned on the defensive side can help that defense, but uh not looking too well. They need to do a much better job. Now, this year, I think at best, I think they're going to go 6-6 six and six this year and become bowl eligible and possibly save Cliff Clingsbury's job as, as head coach for the Red Raiders. So, I'm going to have to go with 6-6 six six for the Red Raiders this upcoming college football season. Now, the next time I'm going to catch you guys will be in just a couple of minutes. I have several more blogs for you for today. Thank you for watching this blog. I'm your man, Keem McCall. Be easy. You street.